What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? I hope I didn't break another pair of sunglasses. It is Mike, and I am in my car, the six, and wow, 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 forgot to take. Yes, I am in Cedar City, Utah, just left Zion National Park on my way to Canyonland, and I am at the Utah's finest fast food establishment, or at least one of the only ones that's only in Utah. I lied, I lied, I lied. I think there's some also in Southern Idaho. Regardless, regardless, I am at Arctic Circle. Arctic, Arctic. What I got is a Black Angus Ranch burger, a Lime Ricky for a drink, and of course, French fries, but Utah has this weird ass fry sauce, so I'm gonna try that too. But first, the burger presentation, always important. We can see I did get the ranch burger, open it up. Where the good stuff is, yo, where the good stuff at, found it. Oh, burger diaper alert, burger diaper alert. So this is what we got going on. There appears to be ketchup and ranch, which is odd. Maybe one or two pieces of cheese too. Wow, two patties. Big Mac stop. We all know that looking like a Big Mac is only one part of the score. What also matters is taste. So you all know the rules, one bite, score. Here we go. Okay. It's it's an all right burger. It's really nothing special. It's maybe the worst burger I've gotten on my trip, honestly. The bun, a little stale. Uh, everything about it, very average. Really not that great. The ranch is good. Small, small caveat. This is the only Arctic Circle that isn't in Salt Lake City or around there, which is like 200 miles from me, so this one might be a little lesser. Really can't tell that it's Angus beef, black Angus. I don't really know what that means, really. That's just more expensive cow. It's kind of kind of like sunglasses, you know? Like, you see the Oakleys, and you see, like, the $2 ones, and they're the same. You see, like, the black Angus cow and regular cow. They're the same, but one's more expensive. Also, we'll say, very many pickles on it. And if you're a pickle guy, like me, that is lit. But, on to the score. But before we, for the score, we got sponsored by David Pfeiffer who lives in Indianapolis now of course the reasoning behind him sponsoring Arctic Circle is that his fancy football name as well as his stupid fighting ninja move is ice cold milk Arctic Circle ice cold milk Arctic Circle lit 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 this burger very average has introduced me to ranch and catch up together but score wise six eight two six eight two I like it but eh. I will say I got like probably the shittiest one ever made but like quality control man I don't know I don't know I don't know <laughs> Moving on to the fries. Y'all should know the fry rules. Out of seven, eat as many as you can in three seconds. They look really good. I'm also going to be eating them with the fry sauce. Here is a peek at the fry sauce. I was told it's some sort of combination of mayo and ketchup, which sounds absolutely disgusting in Utah, but it's my job to tell you how it is. So before I do the fries, I gotta get composed. Keep my composure! All right. Here we go. Three, three, three. Fries themselves, very similar to Burger King fries, which y'all should know I'm a fan of. Do I have to go over the ratings? Rankings, 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 rankings. Big three fast food fry rankings. Burger King, mad underrated. Wendy's, mad overrated. McDonald's, top dog, top dog, top dog, top dog. Like I said, these are very similar to Burger King fries. Score wise, four eight. Fantastic salt, salt uh, combo. This one's really brown though, so we'll see how that goes. 
for the sauce, let me just put this into the uh, data analyzer. I guess it's ketchup and mayo. I can't really call it. It's it's an odd flavor. It's good. It's okay. It's all right. It's it's fine. I I'd, I'd say it's probably just kind of like tangy ketchup. But then that makes me think it's just Thousand Island dressing, like everyone's secret sauce. Like yo McDonald's, we all know it's Thousand Island dressing. It's not secret sauce, Big Mac secret sauce. It's Thousand Island. But sauce is all right. Kind of kind of. It's kind of close to honey mustard in a really weird way, but it's not. Ketchup's better, whatever. Oh, that was smooth. Last but not least, we got the drink. Beautiful, beautiful cup. Beautiful cup. I love it, Arctic Circle. Beautiful cup. Arctic Circle. It's called Lime Ricky. It might be limeade, but y'all know the fucking rules, or you better know the fucking rules for drinks. One well, weird looking sip, then I tell you how I feel. Hey, Mike, why don't you give him a score? Why don't you just go away? I just tell you how I feel, alright? Alright, here we go. It's very delicious. Um, it's very, very pleasant. I love lime too. This is good shit. I wish I would buy this all the time. It's a little fizzy. It honestly might just be like very limey cola. I fuck with it. Yo, shout out Arctic Circle. Yeah, yeah. Woo woo. That is the review. If you watch, thanks. Really means a lot. If you didn't, I just really don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. If you're a tap, tap, tapper, congrats. 45 calories burned. There are a bunch of like fat Mexican children riding their bikes. You could join them. Peace, love, positivity, positive vibes only. Shout out Kanye, OG. Hope he's still doing his thing. Do good deeds daily. I'm outie. Peace out, y'all. It's lit. Got it all now. What is he worth to both of us now? It's so much as.